Well, guys, it was kind of sort of a spur in the moment type idea, but I told you that my biggest goal for this year was to boost this car. So with that being said, I officially sold the ST last night. As you can tell, it's nowhere here. More to come with this car. Like I said, we're gonna boost it. Um, it should it should be making about like six to like 650, which is gonna be absolutely insane. I know some of you are gonna be very disappointed, but I had to do what I had to do. And I'm just playing with you. I know, I know I got some of you, I know. But uh, truth be told, when I let Lily drive the ST for her birthday, somehow it extended to two days. So I still have her car over there. But I just wanted to take a moment and address some of the comments that I got in the video where I said I was gonna sell the ST. So I wanna address a specific comment that I saw underneath the video. It said, if you sell the ST, you will lose all your subscribers. So if you guys notice, you notice how the channel was not named Boosted ST or Wicked ST or Slow ST. It's because I made this channel to show my life in the car community. Now, like I said in the past, I do this because I want to do it. I don't do it for clout. I don't do it for nobody else. So there are gonna there there is gonna be a time where the SC might fade away from the channel. I don't plan on selling it. I I said it in the past and I, I meant what I said. I don't plan on selling, shut up, goodness gracious. But I don't plan on selling the SD. The whole reason why I got this car, the Nismo, was to have a variety of content. Cause I'm gonna be honest with you guys, even though I love the ST dearly, it gets kind of boring making the same content with the same car. And that's why all the big creators out there, even creators that you guys watch, I mean, the smaller ones, obviously they're still trying to build up their portfolio, but that's why all the bigger creators out there, they have more cars because it's a variety of content. Cause in, in the end, some people get tired of watching the same car, right? So the whole idea was to buy this car. And again, this car was pretty, pretty much bought for multiple things. It was more or less for personal reasons. I bought this car to have a variety of content so I can switch back and forth. That way, you know, the viewers don't get tired of seeing the same stuff every single time. So what I do on Instagram is I show you the new videos that are upcoming. I show you the videos that I just posted. Um, and on YouTube, if you run across my videos, I have your attention for the time being. I show you the content that I have. And if you like what you see, you subscribe. If not, then thank you for tuning in, you know, but I never want to make somebody feel like they have to subscribe to the channel because at the, at the end of the day, no matter how much I say I love, so when I say I'm never going to sell a car, that just really signifies how much I love that car. But it does come a time and point where one has to do whatever they have to do. Like if, if the SC is literally stopping me from advancing to the next level, then no matter how much I love the car, no matter how much I say, you know, this is the thing that started, that started the channel. This is what, you know, got me into cars. This is how I learned how to drive stick. Like, obviously it's going to be a sentimental value. I'm going to do whatever I can to, to keep it. But if it's stopping me from advancing to the next level, then I'm going to have to do what I have to do, you know? And if I lose subscribers over that, then, you know, I, I'm, I'm not going to, I'm not going to sit here and hunt you guys down and send you death, death threats. Like, you know what I mean? Like, do what you have to do as same things I had to do what I had to do. You know, if, if you leave the channel, then, you know, thank you for tuning in. But I want to let you guys know at the same time, like, I understand if the SC is the reason why you guys are watching the channel. Like, I totally understand. And if I get rid of it and you're no longer interested in anything else that I have or the content that I'm pushing out, you're going to unsubscribe. I understand. Like, don't get me wrong. I totally understand. I'm not going to sit here and uh, hold you guys to it. You know, you got to do what you got to do. So... That's that's pretty much what I wanted to say as far as that comment. But everybody else who are saying, you know, bro, I would love for you to keep both cars. Um, but at the same time, do what you got to do. I'm still going to be here watching. I appreciate you guys 100 percent, man, because at the end of the day, like I said, the channel was named my name is true to me is not true to a car. Because at the end of the day, guys, like these cars can be taken away in a matter of seconds, you know, so. No matter if I have this car, the ST, or another car, the channel is still going to stay standing and I'm still going to be pushing out content. So I appreciate you guys 100%. Um, I just want to let you guys know that I want to end on that note. I appreciate you guys 100%. And I want to let you guys know that I do read all the comments. Like, look at all the comments in less than a day that we got on this video. I do read all of the comments. There's a bunch of them saying, keep the SD, keep the SD, don't sell the SD. One saying, would you be willing to ship to Ohio? <laughs> that's, that's hilarious. But yeah, I, I literally read all the comments. So I just want to let you guys know that I appreciate you guys. But you guys know every time I talk to you guys on a uh, somewhat serious conversation like that, I always talk to the camera. I never really point the camera away, but it's so easy, even for me, for as long as I've done, been doing this, it's easy for me to get sidetracked when I have a camera pointed at me. So I just wanted to point the camera away, make sure I touch all the points and uh, just wanted to make sure that I didn't say something and mean another thing. So uh, let me say this. 
when being a content creator, it's very important to know like who's watching your channel, why they're watching it, are they watching it because of you, you as a person, or are they watching it because of the content that you're putting out, or like there's a certain thing in your videos all the time that they're coming back for. So that's kind of sort of why I did it. I wanted to reach out to my subscribers and kind of just see what they felt. And that's why at the end of the video, I told you guys, comment down below and let me know what you feel. But at the end of the day, I appreciate you guys. So I gave Lily the option on what car she wanted to drive for her birthday, which is already passed for you guys, but it's in two days for me. Um, but I asked her, I said, you want to drive the Nismo or you want to drive the ST? She chose the Nismo because the ST exhaust is too loud. And that's how you know it's bad. If the drone of your exhaust stops you from driving your car on long trips, that's how you know you need to switch something up. So she chose the Nismo. So we're going to go get a full tank of gas in it and uh, we're going to clean it up because look how dirty it is. No, sir. You guys know I like driving clean. They got a BMW at the gas station getting serviced. And there's a bunch of smoke that just flew everywhere. Yikes. 61 smackaroos. Right when I get back from Modesto, I'm coming right back here to fill it up. I'm gonna tell you guys something that it's probably gonna hurt a lot of people's feelings, but if you were to put the ST and the Nismo side to side and compare them, the Nismo is overall a better car than the ST. I, I know that's gonna hurt some feelings, but it's true. Like, this car is overall, like, I, yes, it's more expensive to mod. Everything's more expensive. To go boost, obviously, this car is NA. The ST is not, it's boosted from the factory. Like, everything's gonna be more expensive when you're trying to mod it. But the power to money gain is 100% worth it. Cause for basically around 11, $12,000, you can have this car to 6 to 650 horsepower at the wheels. When you spend about 8 grand 8 grandish in total on the ST, you're you're getting about like 4 to like 450 horsepower. So for spending what is that? 4 more grand and getting 250 to 300 more horsepower like that's it's a conversation nobody's really ready for though. I know and I own both so I can I can really speak on it really heavily But I love both cars because they're both different obviously in their own ways But I just forgot I say that because I actually had a couple people ask me uh, Which one you like better and there there was actually somebody who was Thinking about trading in their ST for a Z and they're asking me like what I thought about it And I told him like the ST is more like sheltered and the Z is like a raw filling car so like I said, I, I, it's a conversation I think you guys aren't ready for, but if you know, you know. I'll tell you this though, no matter what car you're in, this is always the best feeling ever. It is such a beautiful day out here, man. And I can't wait for summer. Summer views. Imagine the summer sun on this paint. Sheesh. That's what I'm here for. <sighs> I love this car. Here's a little odd uh, fact. I'm allergic to cats. All right, we're back at home. Let's get this car washed up. I hate that I actually ran out of uh, some of my Hydrocylix products because they actually work pretty good. Like the wheel cleaner, it stinks, but it works good and I ran out of it. Bye. 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 Alright, so we're all done cleaning the Nismo, so you're all ready and set for tomorrow. So, I'm gonna go inside and take a shower. We're gonna be going out for Lil's birthday tonight. It must be nice celebrating your birthday all, all uh, weekend, huh? Literally did something yesterday, then we're doing something today, but with all the friends, all the youngsters. And then uh, tomorrow, we're gonna be leaving to a private location that I'm taking her for the rest of the weekend. I'm just waiting for her to get back because uh, I haven't had the ST all weekend. I don't know, I feel kind of weird. I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it not being here. That means they're going to be hot and they're cold. Let me get a fit check, girl. Oh, me? Yeah. Oh. So that's what you looking like. I don't have my shoes, though. I don't have okay. my shoes, though. Looking nice and pretty. Okay. Like always. Look at her. Always. All right, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, Bro. give me. Come on, come here. See me? See me? Eh, eh, you all right. <laughs> <laughs>
Đúng rồi. Đúng rồi. Listen. 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 Listen.